Hi everyone and welcome back to this Trappy and Next.js tutorial series. In the previous video, we added the slugs um, and constraints to our uh, entity types, both the, con the, the jobs and the companies. And if you look at our model, the only thing remaining um, are the relations and the, um, the skills tags, okay? The skills uh, fields in the job uh, entity and again if i go to the to the, to the actual uh, application here the final uh, implementation you can see that we can filter job by tags uh, we can add tags and remove tags and filter and each job has a specific set of tags as you can see here okay so um how do we deal with that well if i go to uh, containful uh it's the containful cms where we build the exact same application and which is the one currently deployed here, you see that Contentful has uh, a very specific way of handling tags. Uh, and because these are so useful for you to be able to filter um, um, uh, your content, um, different CMSs uh, will give you different ways of dealing with the tags. Uh, but Strapi is very um, already in and of itself is one of the most flexible in my experience uh, CMS so um, they don't give you a, a tag um, um, a specific mechanism of dealing with tags so what you're going to do instead you're going to create another entity type um, called tags uh, and we're going to link those tags to um, our job entity type and that's how we're going to deal with tags so let's do that here I'm going to add tag okay advanced settings I'm going to localize it as well okay and the first thing we want to give is the name of the tag okay we're going to give the, here the name and here I'm going to add the constraints for, uh, uh, all at once this year this also is unique okay so let's add another one um, the next one we want to add is um, uh, the type of the tag okay the type of the tag uh, and I think this should be yeah I think I think let me cancel this good let's add the name and then for the for the type i want this to be an enemy okay because um we want the tag to be either a skill tag or uh, i don't know um uh, or order okay but basically just like we did here um the tag in contentful the way we uh, specified if a tag was a skill it was by adding the prefix skill dot okay and here in, in strapi we would like to uh, specify if a particular tag is related to us it's, it's a tag that is meant to be a, a, a skill a skill set then yeah we're going to choose this type of skill okay and for all the other ones we can add other we can as the application evolve we can add other types here but these two for now are just going to be a perfect for us okay by default we can just say that it's a skill uh, and then yeah i think this is this this is uh this is excellent okay so let's save this very good fantastic so now that we have the tags um that's how we're gonna uh, link those to um we're gonna link those to um um the uh the job um type and that's how we're going to link the two so we're going to see in next videos how to do to create entities uh, relations between our entities as you can see here we have already like one two and because of the specific way we are dealing with tags in this application we can have three uh, relations okay so let's do that in the next videos thank you for watching